morning guys today is thursday it's quite late in the morning i've only just woke up i think i don't know what's going on i'm just not sleeping very well lately and i think it's because i can't get comfortable and then by the time i do get comfortable it's like early hours of the morning so i don't get a lot of sleep if you know what i mean i'm like tossing and turning i'm getting up to go pee in the night i'm just not what do you call it sleeping very well at the moment and like overnight i can't sleep because i don't know if it's insomnia i don't know um so i'm not going to fall asleep till like one anyway so i hope i could try to change <laughs> I yawned i hope i can try and change the sleep schedule i might try and go to bed at like 10 tonight or something so i fall asleep earlier maybe because this i just i can't this can't carry on but when the newborn comes, if you know what I mean, like, I'm gonna need to be up and stuff, and I can't be this tired and stuff, so maybe try and change the whole sleep cycle situation. Um, I forgot to do my 36 week bump date yesterday, so I'll just go through a couple of symptoms and then I'll show you a bump shot as I'm only 36 on one day. Um, the only thing really I can think of is as I said, the whole sleep situation is becoming a pain and like not being able to get comfortable but i can't get comfortable in the city either um it's not comfortable to walk around at the moment he feels really heavy and low my pelvis keeps clicking when i get up um especially when i get up from bed it just i don't know what it is but it clicks it's not painful it just feels really weird um my pelvis does get pain though after i've been walking around for ages and then my sciatica plays up um in both legs like the sciatic nerves they really have started to play up um and i used to have that problem before i was pregnant but i think it's because i was bigger and because i'm pregnant obviously i'm heavy i think that's why my sciatic nerves are playing up if that makes sense whereas like um after i lost loads of weight it actually went away so do you think it's about the weight I wasn't yawning before I started filming this. This is insane. Um, yeah, so I think I think it's just to do with weight and pressure when it comes to my sciatic nerves. Um, baby moves all the time, which is really good. Sometimes he moves really abruptly, though, and it hurts a little bit. Um, it feels like he's beating me up from the inside. Um, was there anything else? Waking up to pee in the middle of the night. I like that stopped for a little while. Um, but the last two nights I've woke up to go pee. So that's been kind of annoying. Especially when you feel like you've just got comfortable. Do you know what I mean? Um, that's it. I like being really thirsty. And so this week hasn't been too bad really. I've been really hot as well. And I don't know if it's, like, the because of final stage of pregnancy. Like, it's it's warm out. It's summer. So it's warm out. But not like that June we had. That June was really hot. And I felt like I coped okay. But this time, I'm just... I feel like I need to fan on me all the time. Um, because I just feel hot all the time. So, God knows if it's that. Um, by the time you're watching this, I'll have 13 days to induced. For me, it's two weeks, a fortnight. So it's 14 days, but for you it'd be 13. Um, it's going really quick, so that's exciting. Um, I just kind of feel bad at the moment for Mikey because I'm like, oh, he's not gonna be my only baby, you know? And I just, I don't know, I feel bad for him, I don't know why. I think um, when it comes to having the baby, Mikey's gonna be really excited for like the first 10 minutes or day um, because he's a baby and he loves watching kids and that on YouTube, especially with their babies, he just stares. So, I think he'll be alright for the first day or so. Um, or half hour. <laughs> and then, when it comes to bringing baby home, because it's been in the hospital, when we bring the baby home, after a couple of days, I think for the first month or so, he might play up a little bit. Because he'll realise that that baby's not going away. And he might get jealous. Um, but then, eventually, I think he's going to love being a big brother. Because he, he does, he loves other kids. He loves playing with other children. Um, he seems like quite a sociable babe, quite a sociable baby. So I hope that stays like that. Um, as he gets older, then he doesn't like 
get any like social anxieties or anything like that because he just does seem like a really outgoing little boy which um is a really good thing as everyone knows um so yeah that's what i'm hoping for now i could be completely wrong mikey could love the baby from day one or mikey could hate being a big brother big brother couldn't like just hate it um i don't think he will though so it's really hard to say he is still really young to the point where he won't remember ever being a single child as he's only 18 months old himself so yeah he won't ever remember that if that makes sense um so we'll have to just see won't we um i think it'd be different if he was like three or older then he might actually remember just being only, being only child and i think that could affect it more i don't i mean i don't know i mean some kids they love having little siblings when they're that age anyway don't they so i think it all just depends on the person I'm annoying myself now. I can't believe this. Three yawns in like six minutes. That's insane. Um, as I said, I was not yawning before this. But anyway, I'm going to go downstairs now. Um, and oh, I'll insert my bump shot. I forgot to do my belly shot yesterday. So I'm going to quickly do it now so I can insert it. Um, this is it from the front. It's going to be really hard to see. Um, because I'm wearing black. Oh, wait, I'm doing the camera. But this is it from the side. I feel like I'm getting really huge. Um, I can't really like. Yeah, this is thirty six weeks and two days. So honestly, feel huge. And then. So now I'm going to go downstairs and see what's going on for today. I think it's just me and Mikey hanging out. Because um, Mikey's got work to do at home. So, yeah. Go, go, go. Go, go. Go, go, go. We've just been hanging out, playing. Um, he's gonna have his lunch very soon. I'm just gonna watch the ready, ready, rest of this video, and I'm gonna go and make his lunch. But he's just sitting there with his fire truck, going go 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 go. He started doing it in the car as well. When we stop at red light, he'll go 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 go. I'm like, no, baby, we've got to wait for a green light. Um, he needs like a GoPro or something to film him in the back of the car because he's hilarious sometimes. Go 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 go. Mikey, go go go. Someone's got their lunch. I've got my lunch. I'm trying to hide his yogurt from him. I'm just having some sausage rolls and a pork pie. He's having a sandwich and then a yogurt. Aren't you? Sorry if I don't feel much today, guys. Oh my god. As soon as I put it on, I yawned. Um, anyway, um, we literally have only just woke up from like a three hour nap. So, me and the bubba, he's just sitting there playing with an empty dent and ox. Um, and in his t shirt and nappy. Because <laughs> we're not going to dress today. Um, yeah, because I just, I don't know, like, what was I going to say? I, didn't, I must have just been really tired. I woke up late and I didn't really want to nap today because I'm trying to go I'm trying to try and go to bed early tonight. So whether or not I can, I have to wait and see, won't we? He obviously needed a nap. Um, but I've just been so tired lately. It's crazy. So I've not really filmed anything because I've been asleep for most of the day. Well, not most of the day. It was only like two and a half hours, three hour nap-ish. So um, we're just watching Tay I'm going to be making this dinner very soon. So... Um, yeah, nothing else is really happening. You can press it off in a minute. So, it's really late now. He really wants to press the off button. Um, I know I haven't vlogged much today. Um, we've had dinner, we've just been watching telly, just been chilling about, playing around. Um, yeah, no, it's been it's been nice just spending time, just quality time with me and him. Um, so I'll insert, like, yes, Papa, I'll insert me that now. 
to press the off button. I didn't set midnight rambles here. Hey guys, welcome to midnight rambles. Um, I'm sweating. I've been upstairs and there's no fan in this room. And I just, I just feel really warm. It's not actually that warm out. Um, it was a bit warm earlier and it like drizzled a little bit. So it rained a little bit. But um, yeah, I've just finished editing midnight rambles. was my main point. The baby's asleep downstairs. Um, he first sleep downstairs a little while ago. So Mike's gonna bring him up in a minute. I think so um yeah he's gonna put him in his bed and then I think I'm just gonna go downstairs watch some YouTube and crochet because I feel very close to the end of that ball of yarn um so I'm hoping to get that done also I wanted to say I knew there was a reason why I wanted to start filming now and I was like what was the re yeah anyway I was editing the vlog and I realised like in a way, I don't know if you can tell, I can tell because my videos, um, you can tell when I'm in a really good mood because I feel like I film a lot more when I'm in a really good mood and then when I'm having one of those meh days, I don't film as much um, or if I'm just like really tired. So it's either like a meh day or like, I'm really tired day. Um, I still do try, which I think I should still have a pattern about for to be honest, rather than just not filming, excuse me, with hiccups, rather than just not filming at all. Um, because I feel like yesterday's vlog, which would be, which would be the one that I'm talking about now, um, I filmed quite a bit, um, and we wasn't really doing anything anyway, but I just, I've, I did, I had a really good afternoon with the baby, and it, I just, I don't know, I had a really good positive, positive day, which I really do, did need lately, because I've just been having mental breakdowns which you don't see because I don't film them obviously and I don't want to film them or talk about them because I don't want that to be what my channel is about um I know that I try I mean I try and be raw with you and show you as much as possible but those very vulnerable moments of mine um aren't just vulnerable they're like downers and i don't want to put people down or make people feel bad or anything like that that's not what i'm at that's not what my aim is for this channel it's just about being like a fun family friendly channel about my life great memories for me to watch back on obviously i don't want to watch back on me like blowing my eyes out and getting stressed over the simplest things just because my hormones are all over the place um which it is mainly lately do you know what i mean um I don't want to watch that sort of stuff back. Of course I don't want to watch that stuff back. Um, so, yeah, like, there's there's been a lot going on, what I have been cutting out, and I just had such a good day today, which would be yesterday for you guys, um, that I think I needed, you know? Um, it also is helping that I'm getting really excited about the baby coming. So um, that's obviously keeping me on a high. Hopefully I can stay on this high that I'm having um because I'm, i've just been feeling really good so well, who knows what happens today in the what happened today because um i don't know if you can know i don't know if you can, you're able to tell though if that makes sense um especially when like because obviously mikey's he's 18 months old and he's going for his terrible twos early so sometimes he's just a mizog or he's just he's playing up he's being all he's testing boundaries and stuff like that and there's some days where it's stressful and obviously i don't want to show that on camera for both of us like for both reasons for me and for him um and then other days he's just really a happy little boy like he usually is so it's just kind of a hard time at the moment being heavily pregnant and dealing with that with like to, the, like the tantrums i don't know what it's gonna be like when we've got a newborn so i'm rambling on about it i don't really know what my point is other than I've just been feeling really good today. Um, and I think it it shows in the amount of footage I got. Can you see that shadow? There's a moth in here. My life is controlled around moths. Um, actually, we've not had that many moths lately, which is really good. We had one in the bathroom for a while and I called him Morris because he was there for four, more than three days. I thought, oh, he deserves a name then. And he was the only one in there. He wasn't bothering anyone, so I just left him. Um, but then he disappeared, so I don't know where Morris went, but, um, this one, I think he's quite big, I can't, he's right at the light and I don't want to look into it, because you know you get those, like, fuzzies in your eyes, are horrible. Um, I've offered on for enough now, to be honest. If I finish my blanket tonight, I'll show you that on Midnight Rambles, if not, 
you probably would have seen it in the beginning of the vlog anyway because I would have filmed it today, which is tomorrow for me, today for you. If that makes sense. I'm sure it makes sense. I'm sure everyone's got the memo, right? If not, it's just me rambling anyway. So it doesn't really matter, does it? But I just... And also, um, quickly, very quickly, you guys have made me very happy as well. Like I did say in my last video, in my Midnight Rambles, how grateful I am. Um, and blessed I've been feeling because of your your support. Um, it really does. It has helped, basically. So just thank you um, for being here for me and my family. Um, yeah. I have to be quiet. The baby's asleep. But this is what the blanket looks like so far. So, like, I want to make it the size of the bed. And, well... We're definitely getting somewhere. I mean, this is the size of my hand, so it's pretty big. Um, just it's gonna take a lot more work, like when you compare it to the bed. So I've used all the all this yarn now, which is good. Um, but yeah, definitely getting somewhere. That was the end of Midnight Rambles. Um, I'm probably going to edit tomorrow um, morning. So this vlog might have been late if it wasn't. Sorry for that. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you all tomorrow in my next video. Say bye. Mikey, do the bye. Bye.